Hi, everybody. I hope everybody's doing well. So I have prepared this video so that everybody that's having a problem with a Discord channel can learn exactly how to uh, use it. So basically, this is the Discord link that I had sent on the community group. You just click on the link. I'll take it and paste it somewhere else. So it should show like this. You should accept the invite. There's a capture. Okay, now you should pick where you're from. So I'm from the Middle East. Next, I'm in year three. First of all, you're going to land on the server guide. I want you to go down here and read the frequently asked questions right here. You can see all of them here. And then I want you to go to the rules. I want you to read these rules, please. And when you arrive, actually, it's, it's going to show that you've arrived. This is my name on the new account that I have made. And now this is the announcements channel where um, let's say we're sending a clinical case today or tomorrow or whatever time we're going to send that clinical case. You're going to receive an announcement right here. OK, an announcement for the mentoring department as well is going to be sent here if someone is explaining something and so on. This is for the events if we're going to have events in the future. And then this is dedicated for the clinical cases department, where in this channel, the medical trivia channel, the case is gonna be sent right here, as you can see. Yesterday, a, a case was sent. And then how you answer it is that you should react with um, the emoji of the uh, right answer, of what you think is the right answer. And after like 20 minutes, the, the correct answer is gonna be revealed. And based on that, if you answered correctly on the scoreboard right here, you can see your points. Okay, Muhammad has three points. He's in the first place for now. So by the time uh, the clinical cases are over, the winner is going to uh, receive a certificate. Here is the here is the general discussion. We can all talk here. Just like the WhatsApp community, we can talk here too. These are Q&As if you have any questions for us. And this is off topic if you don't want to talk about medicine, for example, and so on. So then we have these channels that are dedicated for each year separately. For example, year one, year two, and so on. So in year one, you can press the discussion and ask any question about year one. For example, this professor, how do they teach? Do, do they have something specific that I have to learn about? For resources, our team is sending resources for you to benefit from. This is for year one. We can also send you hints. These are the um, previous questions or previous committee questions. And this is a QA, and a any concerns, anything you want to know, then be sure to send us a question right there. And it's the same thing for second year. We we'll also have resources for them uploaded and hints. We also have for third year resources and fourth year and fifth year and so on. So this is the, uh, the lounge. We have a library channel, a podcast channel, and a journals articles channel. So basically what these are is that our team, if we have any book recommendations, podcast recommendations, journals or articles, we're going to send them in this channel, okay? And lastly, I actually really like this last channel because these channels are the study group channels. And through these channels, we can organize study groups. For example, let's say um, this Wednesday, guys, from 6 to 9 p.m., we're going to study together. Uh, join us on the Discord channel. And what's nice is that it's not like Zoom or any other platform where um, within 45 minutes is going to shut down. No, um, 
you don't have a limit on it. You can study and be on the channel for as long as you want. And what I really also like about it is that when you study with a group, it gives you more discipline and you're going to have more accountability towards your studies. So there is an open cam. So for the people that are very serious about it, they can open their cameras and study. And there's the option of not having open cams if you want that too. So basically, it's very simple. This is the Discord channel. It's very simple. And I hope this was um, helpful for you. And bye.